friends welcome back to my channel and today we are going to learn more about terraform.pfwars or we can say simply that pfwars file so without wasting any time let's get started so the foremost thing that we are going to learn is what are these pfwars file and why do we require it right so the foremost thing is we require these file to parse a large number of variables like for example i have taken an example over here wherein i have declared variables.tf as well as outputs.tf right so in this within the variables.tf what i have done is like i have declared a variable name along with the location right and then i have just those values out over here right with the help of output only this what this is what i have done okay now when i run terraform browse command it will prompt me to enter those values right so in case of location let's say and enter now the output over here is my name is gauri and i live in pune okay so it is asking me to enter the values of those variables over here right but if what if i have such variables okay so in that case it is not at all feasible for me to write each and every value for that particular variable so in that case what i can do is i can simply go and declare a file named terraform.cfwars okay now in this what i'll be doing is i'll be just considering the name of the variable first okay in the form of key value pairs i will be entering those values of उटपुट लेट मी शो यूम it didn't prompt the values of these variables and it directly gave me them. so by default it considers if there is a file named terraform.tfwars terraform will automatically use these values as an input to those variables okay so that is what it is okay so after this now this is the first step right now you can also pass variables like terraform plan what is that is if i pass variable right so suppose i want to pass the variable for name okay it's just try to give some other name. Now you can see this thing like my name is Sonia and I live in Pune. Now why did this happen? I to have passed Gauri over here in my Terraform dot tf files. Then why is it showing Tony over here? Why? Because I entered the value of this variable as Tony to command line. So there is a concept of precedence. Okay. So let me show you. I have already opened the documentation for that. Over here, you can see that this variable definition has got some precedence. Since we have got multiple ways to pass the variables, right? We have got a way wherein we can directly use environment variables. We can use Terraform dot tf wars. We can make use of hyphen wars. wherein we can pass the values the variables through command line itself okay 
So, this is the sequence. The later one takes precedence over the earlier ones. Like, for example, if I have defined a variable name, and within the terraform.tf bars, I have entered some other value, then it will consider the value within the terraform.tf bars and not the environment variables. If I have used hyphen more, and I have also declared few variables in the terraform.tf bars. So this hyphen more will take the precedence over this particular, that is it will consider the variable that you have mentioned to this particular hyphen var and not in the terraform.tf vars. So that is the thing that is very crucial. So this is the precedence that we need to understand. Okay. So in this way we can work with terraform.tf var. I will also try to create one more file. Suppose and uh, consider it as test.tf var. Okay. Just try to in give the key value pairs for my variable. Okay, so if I consider Tony, the location is your. Just try to save this. Okay. There is another TF bars, right? So this is another one. Now, if I directly go. Uh, plan it's good to by default consider terraform.tf wars that is these values you can see over here it's showing my name is Gauri and I live in Pune right but what if I want to enter these values which are other than terraform.tf wars right so there may be a situation where I want to make use of another set of variables which are huge in number so in that case what I'll do is I will just use Terraform plan hyphen In case you can see that it shows my name is Tony and I live in New York. It has now considered the values that are mentioned in the test.tf1. So in this way, you can play with it and try to understand like how we can make use of terraform.tf wars and how it proceeds, okay? How var file can be used to override my terraform.tf var, right? So this is quite interesting and you can play around it to get a brief idea about what it is actually. Right, I will mention the this documentation link in the description for your reference so that you can go through it and try to understand like how can we pass the variables. Okay. So that's it for this. Hope you found this video helpful. Please like, share and subscribe to my channel if you found the videos helpful. Also don't forget to press that bell icon for the latest updates. So thank you so much and have a nice day.